Okay, so thank you guys for tuning back in. And here is the final uh, part to this video. Basically, we are in the phase of where we're going to cut and style this. So as you can see, it is so much hair. This is so much freaking hair. It's, um, I believe it was six or seven packs. Um, however, it still was really not enough, even though I am saying this with it being that much. Um, which I explained in the previous video on why it ended up not being enough. However, what you're going to see is I'm just going to, um, spray the hair with water. And, um, as I'm cutting it, trying to get a feel for it to know where to cut. Um, eventually I did put the paddle brush down. It was not helping at all. But basically you guys just want to follow this process and you just want to cut the hair and frame it to your face. Um, I will be cutting the hair at an angle because I'm going to be creating layers in it. And then we will have a few other steps towards the mid and the end of the video where I will come back and explain to you guys what I'm doing. But in the meantime, just watch what I'm doing. Hope you guys find this informative and I will talk to you guys in the next clip. So what you guys see me about to do right here is I'm sectioning off part of my hair and I'm pulling it down to see where I want the layers to start to fall. And then I'm just going to cut that excess hair that's hanging out. Be careful. I did end up cutting my finger. It wasn't too bad, but it was just like a little small snip or whatever. You see me hacking away in the video. But, um... Yeah, so this is going to just, I just pulled, I guess you would say the hair from the end of my eyebrow. And you'll just grab the hair, pull it down to your face, find out where you want the first um, layer to be. And then just cut whatever is hanging out of there. And then I'm going to pull the rest of the hair up from the top of my head only just I'm gonna pull up the sides too but do the top only and you can grab just a tad bit as you can see with my head being held down just a tad bit from the middle not too much and then you're just going to pull that up into that first layer that you cut and then just cut the rest of that and this is a little quick trick um, on how to create long layers um, you always want to go a little bit with curly hair a little bit longer than where you want it to be because curly hair does tend to shrink. So I hope you guys understand what I'm saying and I hope this helps. So just continue to watch and you will see me, um, you'll see me cut the rest of the hair. And then also I'm going to use my thinning shears along with hair cutting shears. Now thinning shears, um, is kind of like. I guess you would say it's blocked up shears. I'll hold up a picture to it. I mean, hold up, a, um, hold them up to the camera so you'll be able to see them. Just follow the video and you should, you guys should be okay.
about here, basically what I'm doing is I'm spraying the hair just with plain warm water. Um, so I don't, me personally, it's just too much hair for me. It's too big the way it is. So I want to tame the curls down a little bit. So what I'm going to do, as I say that I'm spraying the hair just with some warm water. And then from there, I'm going to apply a curl activator cream. And that's going to make the calm, the curls calm down a lot more to where the hair is not so, so big. I think it's beautiful, but for me personally, it's just way too much hair. So you can use any curl activator cream that you have. Um, I'm going to use the one that is by Afrogy. Um... I like it. I, this is my first time using it on synthetic hair, but normally I'll use it on my oldest daughter Nyla hair for a wash and go. And it turned out pretty good. It worked really well for me. And then after I apply the curl activator cream, you're going to see me diffuse the curls with the, you're going to see me use my blow dryer to diffuse the curls to dry it because I did have church the next morning and it was like, you guys, I think it was like two in the morning I was doing my hair. So I was extremely tired when I got up for church. But anyway, praise be to God. I went to church anyway. Um, and my hair turned out beautiful. I loved it. And I hope you guys love it too. If you want to try it out, let me know down in the comment section. Don't forget to thumbs this video up. If you like it, don't forget to share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys for tuning back in. As always, I appreciate you so much. You guys have a blessed day. Bye.